and welcome back to another YouTube video. I haven't even started off this vlog. I went and got my toes done. I got a like navy blue purplish color on my toes and it was super relaxing. I definitely needed a pedicure. So I did that and then I went to my dad's house and hung out with him for a little bit, like a few hours actually. I went to two different Starbucks because the one by my dad's house closes at 1.30. But I got the fall drinks i got two of them this is my second year in a row getting this drink i discovered it last year but it is just an iced coffee or you can get a cold brew or you can get a shot of espresso double shot of espresso whatever you prefer and then just get chestnut praline cold foam on top and it is so good i haven't even taken a sip of it yet and then christian wanted to try the sugar cookie almond latte we're gonna try that too but i got it with oat milk because they were out of almond milk i'm gonna take my first sip of chestnut praline cold foam is so good they didn't have the christmas cups for the ice yet but they had them for the hot drinks but definitely try iced coffee or whatever your preference is with chestnut praline cold foam. It's so good. Okay, Christian is gonna try the drinks. Which one do you wanna try first? Mine. Mm -hmm. I think that one's really good. It's pretty good. What do you rate it? <clears throat> What? It's a, You're never it's a, there. It's a 7.7. .7. He's always so... 7.7. .7. Okay, that's a little bit higher than I was expecting. I think it's pretty good. 7.7. Without 7. milk in it. 7.7. 7. 7.7. Uh, it's a 5.9. 5.9? Can you hold Yeah. Oh, it's raised up. Um, speaking of Christmas, I... Okay. Well, speaking of Christmas, I have a Christmas mug that's in the mailbox, and I'm gonna go get it. I'll show you it when I get back. I'm so excited. So I probably want to go back and get my master's. Which I might do. What? Yeah. No, you're such a liar. You would never. You would never go back. You're funny. There would be no need for you to go back. I'd be concerned if you went back. I just got this Christmas mug in the mail. It has a Christmas tree in the bottom of it focus on it and I'm unfortunately I can't link it I got it off Poshmark because they don't sell this mug anymore it's originally from anthropology I can put the name of it down below just in case you want to search for it but they have different figures that are in the bottom this one's just a Christmas tree but they also have a candy cane and a snowman and I liked the Christmas tree in the bottom I thought it was cute it'd be cute for like my morning lemon water or just coffee so thought it was so cute because I have another Christmas mug and I saved it from last year. It's the Starbucks one. It's like the candy cane handle. I got this off of Poshmark too. So if you're looking for certain mugs that are out of stock, look on Poshmark because I got both of these off Poshmark. I want to start using these now, but I feel like it might be a little bit early because it's only the beginning of November, but I'll link the name down below just in case you want to search Poshmark for it. But other people are selling the snowman one and the candy cane one on Poshmark as well. So I'll put the name down below. Okay, I just changed and there's football going on in the background, but I just changed and got ready for dinner. Christian and I are going on a double date with my brother, Steven and my friend Sarah. We actually went to high school together, I think partially. I don't know if she went to the same high school the full four years, but we've known each other for a really long time. But we're going to Prado, which is on Park Ave. 
So if you live in Orlando, you probably know about Prado and if you don't, you need to check it out. It's on Park Ave, it's so good. I usually get the mustard spaghetti, which is a pasta dish. It's delicious. Just changed, I already had my hair and makeup done and I put on, it's cold outside so I can wear some winter clothes. So this is the fit, I'll bring you guys along. I'm gonna try and get a photo of my outfit but I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. So we'll see. mission to Bed Bath & Beyond to find a new pillow. I woke up with the worst neck and back pain and I have been for the past three weeks now and I just don't even remember what it's like to have a good night's sleep and I know that I hold a lot of tension and stress in my shoulders as most females do. I've never gotten a massage before. I know I'm like a, a crazy person. I don't even know what it's like to have a massage done. But I was using Christian's massage gun. He has one of those. I was using it on my shoulders and my back and three weeks ago when I first woke up with it, I like physically couldn't wash my face because I couldn't like bend down to get my face wet and I couldn't like turn my head like it hurts in my back to like turn my head like this and I'm a back sleeper I have a pillow that is like meant for back sleepers it's like a Tempur-Pedic type of foam pillow and it's just not doing it for me anymore I don't think I think it's just worn from me sleeping on it every day for like over a year so I'm gonna try and get a new pillow I don't know I don't know what I'm gonna do it really sucks and I'm in like a lot of pain and yeah so we're on a mission to bed bath and beyond okay enough complaining it's gonna be a great day i'm gonna try and relax i'm gonna meal prep to get some more self tanner and we're gonna turn this day around we're gonna push through there are worse things in this world but hopefully this pillow thing fixes it <laughs> today not really doing anything I've kind of been very bad at vlogging this weekend but I wanted to show you what I ended up getting from Ulta I needed more self tanner and I got Bally body instead of the Saint Tropez one I got the mitt I got a new mitt by Saint Tropez but I used to use this Bally body one hour express tan and you can leave it on for up to three hours as well I used it I want to say two years ago and it's one of my favorites. And I haven't been able to find it in Ulta so I started going back to the Saint Tropez one. 
And then I just saw an Ulta when I went today, so I decided to switch it up and pick it up. And then I'm also trying the face tan water because I have been using the Isle of Paradise drops, but they just haven't been doing it for me lately, so I haven't been tanning my face. And my face does not match my body. So I wanna try this. You just apply it like a toner. So you use a cotton pad. So we'll see how that works. Then I got another one of these and a new mitt. And I went to Target after because I needed to get a specific rice that they had. I'll explain later. But they only had it at Target. I tried to get it at Costco last weekend and they didn't have it anymore. So I found it at Target. And I don't know if it's too early to switch to Christmas decor. We haven't put up our tree yet, but I want to in the next few weeks. Maybe the weekend of Thanksgiving or the weekend before. I don't know. But I figured it's time to switch out this area for... I mean, I'm still going to burn pumpkin candles, but I got this fireside spruce candle from Target and it literally smells like a Christmas tree. So I wanted to switch up this area to this. Does that even look good? Does that candle look too big? But this candle smells so good and I went to a Target that I don't normally go to and the Target that I go to all the time doesn't have this candle sitting out ever. I've never seen it. So I'll link this candle down below just in case you want to order it online. And I also got this tree. And they have tons of little trees, but this one lights up. <laughs> and they also have a smaller one of it. And you can put it on a timer so it shuts off and it just takes batteries. Or you can leave it on or obviously you don't even have to have a light. The light on. But I kind of wanted to change up the little centerpiece from I've had this pumpkin since the beginning of September when Trader Joe's first got them in. So I figure if I started buying pumpkins at the beginning of September, then it's totally normal to buy a little Christmas tree decoration at the beginning of November. Oh, and this is the pillow that I ended up getting. It's adjustable memory foam pillow. I'll show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like, just it's very firm, which is what I need. I'm a back sleeper and like a partial side sleeper, but I feel like I need the support of a firm pillow. Even though when I was looking for pillows, it was saying that a back sleeper and a stomach sleeper need like a plush pillow, but I don't know, I like it firm. So it's pretty firm and supportive, but still like squishy. So I'm excited to sleep on it tonight. Hopefully I get a good night's sleep. I need one. Okay, this is this week's meal prep. It's ground turkey and then this rice cauliflower stir fry. And then I'm gonna add some extra peas just as an extra veggie. And I'm just gonna cook this with salt, pepper, garlic powder. Then after it's cooked, add in soy sauce to it or a soy sauce alternative. I'm gonna use liquid aminos instead of soy sauce with the ground turkey and you only need about two tablespoons of soy sauce. I've never actually done this recipe before so I don't know if it's good at all. So we'll see. But I really wanted to try this rice cauliflower stir fry and I wanted to use it with ground turkey. So I thought this would be the perfect recipe to meal prep. <music> Krispy Kreme donuts because I feel like every single Sunday we always justify getting ice cream or donuts or something. Cream and I'll be right with you. All right. Which one do you like? So the original cream. 
but I don't like the one with the. I like it. I like. So you see the the cream filling with the chocolate on top. Yeah. I like that, but with glazed. It's all like like the raspberry filled, but it has cream inside. But now they do like this the normal donut with the cream with like the hole. Mm -hmm. It's not as good. So I'm gonna have to go raspberry. Don't they usually put it in a thing? Situated.